What's up, guys? This is Cody Peaster. Um, decided to catch you up on the, you know, everything that's been going on lately. Uh, so it's November has been an interesting month. Um, the last video I, I put up was about like it was like towards the end of October, and it was like right after my main camera died. Well, I mean, it didn't die, but it broke. So, you know, it's currently getting repaired. But until then, I'm using my old camera. My old uh, D5100. So, yeah. Um, hadn't used it. I hadn't used it since 2015 when I got my D750. So, it's going to be a... Uh, it's, it's nowhere near as good, but it'll ha have to do for now. Um, I got some good fall pictures with it, but you know, when I, when I said my last video, but hold, okay, before I get right to the, right into the good stuff, you know, I'll, I'll say that this, that thing, you know, I, things are, I look a little different now. Um, I lost a little more weight, not a lot, but you know, I've also been working out more did uh, I'm up to seven seven hundred push-ups, you know, and so I did say two hundred reps yesterday with my uh, thirty-five pound dumbbells, you know, and biceps. Yeah, I haven't my weight hit, so I might not hit my goal of uh, you know going below two hundred by the end of this year. The lowest I've seen it was. Like 205, you know, because you know it's it's the holidays. It's gonna it's hard to resist the food, but I'm doing better than I did like the last three years in the better shape. But anyway, I look different. Um, uh, I I'd mentioned in my videos before that um, I've had problem problems with my teeth. Um, you know, for a lot, you know, for my past few videos, I had used, you know, like a fake filling, just to kind of hide the gap, like right here. Um. So, but no, I mean, it was a, uh, it was years of uh, candy, eating candy. Um. You know, it just feels really bad. So, I. Uh, this is now denture. This whole top row. So, actually, looks better than my real teeth ever did. I mean, my teeth were always, you know, crooked or, you know, I had gaps. So, anyway, um, oh, another difference is my hair. My hair is uh, curly. And it's actually been curly all month. With a few, there have been a few exceptions where, I don't know, I tried to straighten it. But, um, it was actually curly. Um, like beginning of last month, the hair, my hair dryer broke, so I wasn't able to blow dry it. And at first, I was like, "Oh crap! I better get a new hair dryer soon." But you know, I decided, you know what? Screw it. Actually, I'm just gonna leave it curly. You know, because um, I haven't actually gone out with curly hair on a regular basis since 2009. <laughs> I was like, I was a teenager, so I, I kind of, it's kind of good to see the curls again, you know, I'm just going to keep it that way, so yeah, um, so, went, now to the good stuff, um, when I mentioned in my last video that I, Thought I'd hit the lowest point of my year. That was that was not that was not true actually because things actually got worse a couple of weeks later. Um, so it, it started uh, the eleventh of November. Um, my phone broke. My my phone screen had been cracked for a long time. So. 
And I've had the phone for like my Galaxy S5 for like two years, a little over two years. Um, screen been cracked for most of the year. Um, but finally, you know, it started got some black on the lower part of the screen, and uh, it just like spread throughout that that same day. Start on the bottom. By the end, of, I, by the end of the day, it was all the phone was just useless. All I could do was play music, you know. Which here we go. So that day, I had a I ordered a new one, but you know it was gonna be a little while. It took about a week to get it. What the? I mean, this is it right here. Another Galaxy S5. This one uh, works a lot better. I got the operating system, you know, got new, uh, got Oreo on there. wasn't wasn't easy. wasn't really easy because you know it's Samsung doesn't actually support it on Galaxy S5. Anyway, so yeah, but that week though it was rough. Um, you know, I. I like when my phone broke, you know, I was like, "Well, crap. Oh uh, well. Well, at least I'll, I'll get a, I'll get a new one soon. It'll be all right." But then the very next day, it was cold and rainy. It was like I think it was like 39 degrees when I left for work. It was just raining, and my car broke down. My car broke down. I drive a Ford Escape, like 2006, silver. Um, I was pulling into work, I was like right next to Chick-fil-A, and the car just broke down, it started to make, it slowed down, and uh, it just it wouldn't go any further, it started making a weird like, kind of like a sound it would make if it was, if it was stuck in gravel, except there wasn't a gravel, I was on the road, pavement, so yeah. What the hell? Really? Those are not notifications. Alright. So, my car broke down. So, I, fortunately, I got out right in, in the rain. It was cold rain. Um, fortunately, had a couple of people help me, you know, get, be able to get my car. My car, my car would crank up, would crank up and all that, but, you know. I couldn't drive it, but I mean, basically, put it in neutral. We, you know, push it into a parking spot at Walmart. So I walked into work. I was all soaked. I, I mean, that was pretty much that. That was a low point of this year. So I felt like, I mean, so now, because for, for the following two weeks, I had to be picked up dropped off at work, you know, so, you know, on top of no phone, no main camera, you know, my girl troubles, I was, I was miserable, I didn't know how, I didn't know things were going to get better, I, I felt hopeless at that point, but, I don't know, I, I started getting a little more hopeful next, the following week, though, things did get better, but, you know, I still haven't seen Kaylee. I haven't. It's been almost three months. So, you know, on top of that, I mean, I don't know. It, it, all, it all just happened at once, you know. I just felt, I you could say that this year was kind of a learning experience. Um, I remember being depressed last year, you know. Thinking, you know, my my only issue really last year was, I mean, aside from the, aside from the hurt, I mean, that really wasn't that bad. I mean, yeah, I lost power and I had to throw out my all the food I bought. That I mean, that sucked. But really, my only issue last year was some girl that like I had met. I only knew her first name. And I wasn't I never got to see her again. I thought that was I thought I thought that was bad, but it really it really wasn't. It really wasn't bad. Last year was not a terrible year, for the most part. Since this time last year, I had you know all my stuff. 
at least. <laughs> I was driving. But, you know, I did finally get my car back uh, actually a couple days ago. So, things are looking looking up. You know, got my got a new phone. Uh, this time I got a screen protector. Works just brutal on my brutal thumbs. Uh, Alice Cooper, nice. I got like almost 40 bands on this phone. Took me a while to rebuild the playlist, but I got it. I got like several, I got a few decades of, turns out I got like freaking 12 hours, I think. Yeah, 12 hours of Alice Cooper. I mean, that's pretty good stuff. But anyway, so back, back on topic here. So I thought, you know, I thought I was on the, I thought I'd reached the lowest point of my, I don't know, things, this year kind of put, this past month really put me in perspective, you know. I just gotta remember, things could be worse. Yeah, I'm not where I want to be right now. No, I'm, I mean, you know, I'm still struggling with this girl, but it could be worse. I could lose my job. I could lose my laptop. You know, I could lose important, you know, valued family mem member, which I almost did. You know, my sister. I, I don't want to get into details about that. Really, don't need. But you know. You know, I'm not going to get into details about that, but, you know, things things do work out in the end. Maybe, maybe I'll see Kaylee again. Maybe, I, I don't really, I still don't know really what the deal is, what's going on with Kaylee. You know, I don't know why she came in my life. I don't know why I'm still thinking about her. I don't know. But, you know, I just gotta, I mean, I gotta, I gotta be grateful for what I have right now. Um, I might be single for a good while longer, but I have a, I have a job, I have a car now, got a good phone, you know, I have a great family, can't feel anybody cares about me, um, you know, my friend's family, they care, my friend's work, they care about me, <sighs> you know. It's, it's all right. So, um, I'm just, uh, yeah. <laughs> hopefully, you know, hopefully my camera will get fixed soon. This one's nowhere near as good. I really only use it for landscapes for the most part. I mean, because the autofocus is absolute terrible. Usually for landscapes, I can just, you know, lock the focus and just keep it like that. But for close-ups, you know, the focus is always off. I have to adjust it every freaking time. So, you know, it's a cool routine. But it's all right. There have been times where I had no camera, and I used, like, a phone, you know. 2013. Early 2013, I had, uh, you know, that camera was the only one I had. And that one was, that one was getting repaired, so I had to use my old. That was my, that was my first phone, and that really did have a crappy camera. Not a Galaxy S5. That was before the Galaxy S5. That was a, it was a low budget Samsung phone. So, you know, what I mean things. I also didn't have my laptop. My laptop was not working at the time. So I was using an old crappy one. So like I said, things things could be worse. Things are they're all right right now. I mean, playing the Sims right now is really right now is really all, all I can all that's going on right now. So it's okay. Things uh, things should work out. Now that I got my have my car back, at least uh, I mean, at least I can, you know, try to go out and do things. Who knows? It, it'll be all right. Uh, maybe someday, someday the whole Kaylee thing will make sense. I don't know, but you know, I'm gonna. I think I need to wrap this video up. I gotta work today. Uh. 
also need to work out. You know, I do my 700 push-ups before I go to work today. Now, honestly, I've come to realize that even with all the working out I've done, my lot of women has not changed one bit. I mean, they still ignore me at the same amount as they did when I was 13. It's like 5'3", high-pitched voice, fat. I mean, <laughs> I mean, honestly, uh, women just don't like me because I'm me. I, I don't know. I mean, I'm just, I'm an acquired taste. Maybe I won't find that good, that right girl until I leave Walmart. So, you know, if this uh, whole Kayla thing blows up my face, which it probably will, I'm just like not, I'm not going to get attracted, no, not attracted, not going to get caught up in any more girls for a while. At least not until I leave Walmart. I mean, that's probably the, the way of what I needed. I mean, I, I can't make the same mistake again. I don't know. Well, I guess that's it. I gotta go do more push-ups. Get ready for work. Okay, we're done here.